Hi, I'm Puya Hashemi, founder of the SIP Awards, and today we're gonna go through the Judge's Spirit Tasting Kit. First, let's go through what's included in your kit. You've got your instructions on how to take notes as well as submission process and your submission form. We've included your SIP Awards pen, a palate cleanser, which is coffee beans, your knee glass, which is scientifically proven to get the most out of each sample, and of course, in a blind tasting like no other, you're getting a variety of 12 spirits from around the world that you're gonna be evaluating based on aroma, taste, and finish. A couple items that you will need outside the kit, a bucket or an extra glass, a paper towel or a regular towel, and some water. Now I think we're ready for our first tasting. We're gonna take the entry form and it's gonna show us the bottle number one with a number. And we're gonna take that and look for that number on the corresponding samples. Pretty simple, you're just gonna match the number to the number on the entry form. Now we're gonna pour the sample in your neat glass. Getting all of the sample in. As I swirl, I can smell the aroma. Mmm, this is gonna be tasty. I'm gonna go ahead and score the aroma, and now I'm ready to taste. Cheers. Mmm, swirl that, get the flavors, really score it on A to F based on what you really like. A being great, just like in school, F being really bad. I'm gonna score this one a B. After the taste, we're gonna score it on the finish. And that's how the spirit basically resonated with you. Let's do that. As we score, this is definitely a good spot to put some notes down. Anything we've sensed from flavor profiles to aromas to fruits we kind of detected, this is the spot. Now we gotta set up for the next sample. Here's how we do it. We take the bucket, we dump the contents, the remaining spirit in there. We take some water, pour it in there, swirl it, kind of basically rinse it out, throw it into the bucket, and then we take a towel or a paper towel and dry it. And we're ready for the next tasting. Be sure you're using the palate cleanser to kind of reset your palate between each tasting. Perfect. Now go ahead and repeat that process on the next 11 spirits. Enjoy. Here's some final tips to give you the best experience. You can go ahead and chill your entire kit in a refrigerator before tasting maybe one or two hours. That'll give your palate a little bit of a smoother feel. Remember, you don't have to finish every single sample. You can just taste enough to be able to score accurately. Be sure your notes are as clear as possible because you're gonna be transferring the information on this onto the online form. As you share this on social media, be sure to tag us on all the major platforms, at SIP Awards. Most importantly, drink responsibly. Don't drink and drive. Your feedback is tremendously important to us, to the brands and to the consumer public, both domestically and internationally. We value your opinion, and we couldn't do this without you. Thank you for being a SIP Awards judge.